Okay, so first item of business is I dyed my hair purple. I scared myself the day after I did it. I looked in the mirror and thought, I fell asleep with blonde hair. Which one of the people I live with dyed my hair in my sleep? It took me two full minutes to realize, oh, I did this. Like, I, I it was my choice to do this. I like it. I don't know if I'll be dyeing my hair another color after this. I don't know yet. I really don't know if I want to yet, so we'll see what happens. But it's 2018, new year, new prospects, new opportunities. We've checked off one, checked off a New Year's resolution by getting this done. It's pretty much the only one I had other than read more and get another book published this year which I'm hoping to do is soon because my editor Mackenzie is uh, gonna get one of the books I've already got completely topped up edited and ready for Amazon within the next few months I hope so, I should have a new book. Um, that one, I'm, I'm pretty sure that one's going to sell. That one, it's a thriller, mystery, and that's all I'm going to say about it, because I'm not giving away spoilers. But, it's something that I'd read, it's something that I'd read, it's something that my mom would read. So, I think, I th yeah, I think it'll be good. Well, let's see, what, what happened in, what, it's almost been three weeks into the new year? I've got stuff done. The snow is hindering everything, though. I got registered for college and everything. I was supposed to start Tuesday. It snowed, and snowed, and snowed. It just didn't stop snowing. There's ice on the roads. I'm supposed to have class tomorrow, but if the roads are as bad as people are saying they are, which they probably are, it's not gonna be good. I mean, a little bit of it's melting now, but the temperature's gonna drop again in the next hour or so it's been 10 to 12 degrees or no between 6 and 10 degrees all week I have been layered all week went outside in the snow yesterday with my cousin his half sister who stayed the night with us and my sister. So my sister and my cousin went in the house. And my cousin comes back out. Barefooted. No coat on. Comes running out of the house. To throw snow at his sister. And runs back in the house. He's been going outside in his. Crocs. If he gets sick. We all know why. And if he gets me sick, heaven help my mom. Because I'm s apparently I'm slowly driving her insane. I can't help it. I'm crazy. She knows I'm crazy. I mean, this whole family's crazy, so... I can't say anything. I mean, I'm not trying to drive her insane. I just am. And then, uh... 
nobody's had school all week. All the school has been canceled. Like, all the schools around here. Like, the colleges are even not having class because of it. I don't think I'm going to end up having class tomorrow either. I'll probably have class next Tuesday. But... I, I still... I, I'm getting used to the hair. I'm getting used to it. It's not easy getting used to this. This. Especially from somebody who's had blonde hair their whole life. And all of a sudden, you wake up and, oh, look, purple. Purple. But. I like it. I like the way it looks. I'll, I'll go back blonde. I, I'll go back blonde. Somebody's got to keep their blonde in the family. Oh, okay. My roots need to be touched up a little. Just a little. But that's okay. We know how to do that. We're gonna do that next, soon, next couple days. But we, uh, let's see, let's see. What have, what have I been craving lately? I have been wanting to watch horror movies like the iconic ones. Like I want to go watch, I want to go sit and watch the original it again cuz why not? Why not? I want to go watch The Shining, which they took off Netflix and I'm ticked off about. I want to go watch The Nightmare on Elm Street that I've never watched before. I've never watched Nightmare on Elm Street. Because I was too scared of Freddy when I was little. And I just avoided it. And now I want to watch it. And it's not on Netflix anymore. I want to go and watch Halloween. And I know somebody who's got the movies. All the movies I've just listed off. Uh, my grandma has them. Uh, I'll just have to go over to her house and watch them. Soon. Because... If I don't watch a good horror movie soon, I think I'm going to start reading Creepypasta. And that is not something a paranoid person needs. I'd rather watch a horror movie than go and read Creepypasta alone in the dark. I'd rather watch a mo horror movie alone in the dark. I could watch Arachnophobia, but I already have a crippling fear of spiders. I don't know if I want to watch Arachnophobia. I mean, I want to watch a little bit of it. I want to watch it, but I don't. Like, curiosity's sake, I want to watch it. But for the sake of my own health, I don't want to watch it ever. I think I'm gonna, just going to have to trap myself into watching it. Like I've been doing with Criminal Minds. I've been binging that. And I have to binge... The, there are two TV shows. Three TV shows on my binge watch list this year. For now. Stranger Things. Because I've only seen part of season one. Don't judge me. I fell off the wagon. I'm going back to it, rewatching it all. NCIS because Abby is leaving and my heart is broken. That's like that is like Gibbs leaving the show. That, that's worse than Gibbs leaving, actually. I mean, it. Uh, Denozo and Ziva are gone. Abby's leaving. It's Gibbs, McGee, and Ducky that are left, man. And McGee's hilarious, but... I, I miss Denozo. 
I said it. And Stranger Things, NCIS, and Criminal Minds. Because... I don't know. I like crime shows. I think I have a problem with crime shows. What is on my finger? I've got hair dye on my finger. Great. (laughs) But... I've got a problem with crime shows. I mean... Supernatural's been on the list. I've gotten to season six. And I kind of fall off the wagon with she with TV shows because like I'll be sitting here I'll be like this is what's gonna happen sorry what Dean did what it's how it goes and I've got to watch Doctor Who I've got to make it to Capaldi I've only made it to Matt Smith I can feel... I know people that are going to get offended by what I just said. Because I have three friends, four friends that watch Doctor Who. Like, they love it. And they've all seen up to date. And I'm just like, I haven't even seen Ten's generation regeneration man I made it to who did I make it to yeah I made it to David Tennant I love I love 10 but something about 9 makes everything better I like 9 I have since I started watching Doctor Who I'm sorry And my movie list this year, I've got a thousand movies on that list right now. Most of them are superhero movies. I legitimately thought about uh, not watching any of the new X-Men because of the fact that Hugh Jackman is no longer Wolverine and Wolverine's dead. And I cry. But I, I like I like Patrick Stewart and Ian McKellen too much to quit watching it. And Infinity War I I just I need Infinity War. Like I need Infinity War. But what I'm just sitting here thinking is One of the main Avengers is supposed to die. Well, not... Okay. It's either Cap, Tony, and the two... There's two others that are supposed to... That are in the category. I can't remember for sure. But if Cap or Tony dies, if Chris Evans and Robert Downey Jr. stop being in the Avenger movies, I don't think I want to watch them anymore. Like, I'll go back, I'll go back and watch the first ones and just stop after Infinity War if Cap or Tony die. Because, okay, one, Robert Downey Jr. is hilarious. Chris Evans is, Chris Evans and Robert Downey Jr. on set together, it's just fun. I mean... Hawkeye. Hawkeye. It, it's either Hawkeye or Black Widow that are supposed to die. With or, and Tony and Thor, uh, Tony and Cap. One of the Chris's. I just can't wait for uh, to see Star Lord with the Avengers. Oh my goodness. But okay. So they put Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 2 on Netflix. 
Mackenzie's sister, the little one, falls asleep mid Guardians of the Galaxy. And I'm just sitting here. How? She loves Groot. She loves Groot. My mom likes Groot. I'm just sitting here. You people only like it because it's baby Groot. It's baby Groot. Shut up. He's so tiny and cute. You can't not like Groot. You cannot like baby. You can't not like baby Groot. I like Rocket. Rocket Raccoon. I don't know why. I don't know what it is. Maybe it's because I liked raccoons when I was little. I, I, I'm not reading into that. I'm not reading into that. But... Infinity War is going to be sick. Man, it is going to be sick. And what I want to watch most of all is Fantastic Beasts and Where to Find Them Part 2. I want to watch it so bad. I want it. I need it in my life. I need more Newt Scamander in my life. Please. Like, it, it's something I desperately need. Okay, it's been almost 20 minutes. Bye.